Hi and uh, welcome back. This is Chris Proper and today I'm going to be doing an update video for a garbage disposal replacement video. Jay Torres 698 had brought it to my attention that I didn't knock out the dishwasher knockout on the inside. So if you see down below we have this dishwasher discharge hose that's connected to the disposal and inside of this uh, little tube here we will see that there's a knockout in there meaning it's intentionally blocked just in case you don't have a dishwasher and we're gonna disconnect the discharge hose have a bucket ready for any water that may be in the line stick your finger in there there's a dead end so if you were to run your dishwasher it would have nowhere for the water to go. It's really embarrassing and it probably could be quite a disaster. We could remove the whole disposal which I think will be easier rather than trying to stick our hands down in here. Um, actually that's not bad reach. So rather than removing it again I'm gonna take a screwdriver and a hammer or pliers And it's perforated on the outside or the perimeter of this little plug. And so it snaps off pretty easily. And that's what we're knocking out. This is the culprit that will block your dishwasher from draining if you don't remove it from the disposal. So remember to remove this knockout. And an additional update to the video because I don't remember if we did it or not but with anything in plumbing you should always check for leaks so what I did was put the drain stopper in on the side we were working on ran the water fill it up about a few inches and then what we're gonna do is open the drain stopper and might get a flashlight and go down below remove the drain stopper and check for leaks. I, that looks like that's from the dishwasher. When I removed the hose. Might also add that you should have some paper towel to wipe everything but I'm confident that this is fine. With 100% confidence. Cool. I hate plumbing. <laughs> All right, no leaks. Dishwasher can drain. On to the next project.